Hello guys, welcome back to another cold episode. On today's episode, we are back with some more Minecraft. And uh, I found a village near where we had our bees. And I did also find another bee's nest. Uh, so what I'm going to do is we're going to move in here. Oh my gosh, there's a shipwreck right there. Um, yeah, we're going to move in here. Uh, these are actually new chunks for 1.15, uh, which means that we can find some bees around here, which we'll do some exploring in a second. But I'm going to move in. I'm going to build myself a little house right here uh, for myself. Uh, or I'll probably keep it outside of the village so that they're not tempted to use it. I'll probably put it like out here or something. Uh, and then we'll put our bees over here as well. Uh, but I'll kind of get all of that set up and then I will uh, be back with you guys in one second. All right, guys, welcome back. So I've got my bee nests all set up here. Um, and I moved over all of the stuff that we had previously. Uh, we did happen to collect some honeycombs. Uh, I just kind of sat around and waited for the honey to collect. So now we got some. Uh, we've only got the two nests, and I don't know if they... Uh, like repopulate or I don't know like what happens there um, uh, but hopefully they repopulate but what we're gonna do now is we are going to quickly build a little house for ourselves um, huh. I'm gonna put down some of these trees as well um, because I want to use birch for our house. Nice. Um, so yeah, we're gonna we're gonna quickly um, build our house, uh, and then we'll kind of go from there. Uh, but I decided to move it over here to where these trees are, versus where I was originally thinking because I like these trees a little bit better than those trees, and so yeah. Uh, and I want to be near the bees this whole time. We don't need a big house. We just need something small. So, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Whoops. <laughs> and do five right here. And we'll strip it, strip the bark off of it, yeah, uh, alright, did we get any saplings? We did, sweet, I want more birch wood, oh wow, we got a whole bunch from that, that was too close. Accidentally bone milled some grass. No, it's not gonna let the tree grow. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Yeah, we're gonna use birch wood for probably the floor and um, the walls. Now, I don't know if I want logs as well. Let's see how logs look. Whoops. Out of here, pig. Oops. All right. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah. Why you do? Stop. Okay. Um. Hmm. They don't look the best. I'm not gonna lie. They're not the greatest looking. Uh, so we're gonna we're gonna strip those down and see how they look afterwards. So let's chop up this. Uh, I like them. I actually like the the two different color logs right here. I think that looks pretty good. 
Uh, we're gonna open this like that. Yeah. All right, let's put put in the floor real quick. Again, we don't need anything too special. Just something small, something easy. Planks. Boop, boop. And okay, cool. Uh, and then we do have glass in here as well that we could dye. Uh, I don't want to dye it white. So let's do this. We can make some glass panes. Whoops. Uh, not there. We'll put windows in. Yeah, we obviously need more. Sixty-four should be good for our purposes. Nice. Boop, 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 boop. Nope. Damn. <laughs> You're not supposed to be there. Okay. No, 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 no. Okay. Cool. Um, and then. Should I do this? Uh. the like corners and stuff like that we'll do the oak all right hmm I'm really bad at roofs <laughs> so I don't know what to do uh, let's do even another row of this let's make really big windows yeah I like the white glass, looks pretty good. So that's nice. Do that like that. Boom. All right, let's make some birch doors as well. Did I actually use up all of my, oh no. It's like, I'm pretty sure I didn't use up all of my birch. Um. this I don't know what we're gonna do above the door but we'll do something I'm sure <laughs> uh, I don't want to do just like this that doesn't look good well kind of does doesn't look very good from the outside though yeah hmm what if we did Did something like this. Yeah, I like that. I like that. It'll it'll do. Not perfect, but it'll work. Okay, cool. Let's move the bed real quick, right there. We got our chests, we need our furnaces. Uh, let's put them like this. Oops. Alright. We do have some things to smelt up, so. Smelt that up, furnace. Okay. Coolio. So now let's do the roof. Quick. 
Boop, boop, boop. We'll just do a very simple roof. Alright, I'll finish this roof and then I'll show you guys when I'm all done. One second. Alright guys, welcome back. So, for the roof, I just put some half slabs up there. Uh, and then I put in some lanterns for, lanterns for lighting and I lowered them uh, with these fence posts. Hello, spider. Go away. Um, so yeah, nothing too special. Um... But yeah, now we have this all set up, and we got some bees and everything, and it's real nice. Uh, I put some campfires underneath, and I blocked them off so that the bees wouldn't just die to them, which does happen. Um, I just saw one die not five seconds ago um, <laughs> due to that happening, so or due to the uh, them running into the campfires. So that's really disappointing. I hope that they're able to, like, breed and stuff and produce more. I'll have to look into that a little bit and see if we can do anything with that. Um, but we did happen to get some more honeycomb. Uh, so now we have a bunch of honeycomb, which we can use to make ourselves... Or we can make a honeycomb block. But I'm pretty sure... You can make a beehive. Yeah, here we go. So, uh, the honeycomb block is purely decorative, so there's no real point in making that. Um, yeah, okay. It does look like... It does... Because I had four bees to begin with, and one just died. So I do think that they are repopulating, which is nice. Um, but I don't think they'll come out when there's... When they're full of honey. So that's something to keep in mind. Uh, but now we have these beehives, and we're gonna put some more uh, some more trees down uh, near all of these flowers uh, for more bees to populate. Uh, and now that we have these beehives, we should be pretty good. And I believe they work just like regular bees' nests. I think that's what the wiki said. Um, so yeah, that'll be nice. Uh, we just need to make some more campfires uh, for them. So let's grab some sticks. Make about four more. That should be good. Um, but yeah, we're going to set these down. Hopefully we get some bees populated within these as well. Um, let me just use the campfire on that. Boom. And we want to block the campfire again. We don't want our bees dying. So, yeah. That's why this one's, like, completely blocked off really weird, like. Alright. We'll just put a whole bunch of flowers around that. Cool, Leo. Cool, Leo. Whoops. Not what I wanted. Oh, Alright, this one's real tall. Yeah, and luckily the campfire does go through blocks, so it'll still work, uh, which you should have just been able to see uh, the work in there a little while ago. Oh yeah, you can hear them buzzing in there. That's so cool. All right. Oh yeah, you just hear them pop out. That's super cool. Yeah, here they come. Yeah, that's cool. I like the I like sound cues. Sound cues are always super nice. So the fact that there are sound cues for that makes it really, really good, uh, in my opinion. Let's put another tree right here. Yeah, we'll put it. Mm, yeah, put it right here. We'll put the campfire right here. I'm gonna need another block, quick. Before a bee kills itself on it. Alright, there we go. So, yeah, this entire area is full of flowers. We can actually... I think we may have some more. Let me check real quick. Uh, no, we actually don't. We don't have any more flowers. Okay, well, that that's fine. We do have some bone meal, which we can use to make more flowers. Alright, just bone meal. Boom. More flowers. 
Also more grass, but more flowers. Look at that. There's a flower. Cool. Sweet. Alright. And then we can, like, move any of these new ones that we get. We can actually move a whole bunch of these ones that I just... I just saw over here. Uh, we can also explore a little bit more of the area around us and see if there's any other bees out there that we can maybe relocate. And I'll have to look into how we relocate them. Because what I did is I, I moved them with an axe and it seemed to work. Uh, with a silk touch axe. Uh, it seemed to work, but I want to know if there's any other like particular method. Uh, or like if I'm doing it wrong because I did seem to lose some when I did that um, when they were outside of the of the nest so I don't know uh, the nest so I don't know if I have to make sure that they are inside the nest or anything like that um, so I'll look into that as well let's put a whole bunch more flowers just all the flowers so many flowers yes Pollen, flowers, etc. Oh, look at that. Oh, oh, look at it. It looks so good. Yeah, they're just gathering from. Okay, this is really cool. I'm liking where this is going. And now we don't have to really rely on. Um, or now, even if they get full, I think they'll head to. Oh no, they head, they head to the same one each time. But I wonder if, if it's full, if they'll head to a different one, as well, like to one of the other beehives that I've set up. So let's grab one of these glass bottles or some of these glass bottles and use it here to grab up a honey bottle so that we can get a honey block. All right. All right. All right. And let's look at the achievements real quick that we need. We need. Jump into a honey block to break your fall. All right. And then we have move a bee nest with three bees inside using silk touch. And the use a campfire to collect honey from a beehive using a bottle without aggravating the bees. Perfect. We've done one of those. And the other two seem pretty easy. Uh, we just have to get a beehive with three bees. So let's now explore this village and then after that we'll go on a little adventure to see if we can find ourselves some more bee hives or bee nests i should say i think that's what they're called um but yeah let's check out what's over here oh there's two farmers over there which is nice it's always good to see oh there's nothing okay that's d disappointing oh wait i have been here before because i've traded with this guy what the? How oh, interesting. Yeah, this guy wants carrots. This guy wants potatoes. Interesting. Interesting. The reason I think this is so interesting is because earlier I came by. I haven't traded with these guys at all, right? But earlier I came by. And just a little ways that way, there was a, a beehive. And so I was like, oh, this must be a new village that we haven't seen before. But I guess it's not. I guess... Have we seen this ship? Yeah, I think we have. This does look familiar. Yeah, there's nothing even in that. So, yeah. I guess we have been here before. Oh, how interesting. <laughs> That's funny. Alright. Well, let's go on an adventure. And see if we can find any other beehives. Um, now I'm trying to remember which direction I came from. I think I think I came from this that direction ish. So let's head off in this direction a little. Um, I'll see if I can find anything, and if I don't. Uh, I will let you guys know, but I'll let you guys know if I do find anything as well. So, one second. 
Alright guys, welcome back. Um, I found a village that's not the one that we were at, and I originally thought it was, and now I'm like, wait, no, this isn't. Yeah, we haven't been here. Interesting. Oh gosh. Baby zombie villager. Hmm, interesting. Alright, well... So yeah, this isn't one that we've actually been to before. How interesting. Yo, what up, guys? Oops, I accidentally hit him. We chill? Yeah, we chill. You saw nothing. Let's check out this, uh, this village real quick. We got sheeps. Yeah, they've got sheep. Oh, they've got looms. Sweet. Throw it up, dude. How's it going? How's it going? Don't mind me. I'm just exploring your house. Don't mind me. I'm just robbing your emeralds. All right. Hmm. in these houses. Well, this isn't a house, it's a church. Anything in here? Apples? You know what? I'm gonna take them. Why? Because I can. Alright. Well, I didn't really find anything else. Too interesting. We didn't find any bees or anything like that, which is sad. Uh, however, there are lots of horses. Lots and lots of horses around. So that's nice. Wait, hold on. Pumpkins. More pumpkins. This dude's gonna come out. Burn himself in the sunlight. Can you, like, not, dude? Thanks. Thanks, dude. Real helpful. <laughs> oh, wow. We actually got a sapling from that one. One leaf. No. Here you go. Have your sapling back. It's your child. <laughs> uh, Alright. Oh, is there anything over here? Bees is what we're looking for. Looking for some bees. Nah, doesn't look like any. Hmm. Alright, well, we'll head back. I think I know generally where the coordinates are. So I'll, I'll find it, and uh, we'll continue from there. So, one moment. Alright guys, welcome back. So, I discovered something absolutely phenomenal. I can breed bees. I just need some flowers. And then they make baby bees. Which, to be honest, we saw them last time. We saw the baby bees last time, right? We knew that they existed. Um, however... I still believe that baby bees should be the actual size of regular bees. The fact that they're so big just throws me off and makes me not like them nearly as much. I do think that the bees are cool and that honey blocks are a cool addition, especially for redstoners, uh, for redstone engineers, I think is what they prefer to be called or something along those lines. I don't know. Um, but definitely for people who like redstone, Honey blocks are incredibly amazing, but overall for me, eh, bees are cool, like they, they exist and honey blocks or whatever. So now if we stand still, they come towards me and if you give them, oh, oh, ah, ah, it's a baby bee. See, that's how big a regular bee should be and baby bees should be smaller, but apparently that just, that just ain't the case. Where's the other dude? Where's the other guy? I could have... Uh, didn't I have four? I know I had four. Grow up for me. I believe in you. Where's the other dude? Where's the other bee? I 
Alright, well, whatever. Well, whatever. I don't know where the other bee went. So, it looks like we're just getting the one baby bee. But that's nice. That means that we can now repopulate our... Or not repopulate, but... Continue to breed up and get more bees. Which is super nice. I like bees. Bees give us honey. Honey is super good. Honey is super cool. I hope... I really hope that there becomes more uses for bees in the future and honey in the future and it's not just for these useless like honeycomb blocks and stuff like that um because right now like there's not much reason for me to like stick around right we've basically discovered everything once we get once we get a honey block we should be pretty freaking good to just go right so at the moment not that big a deal, but uh, I really hope that there becomes more uses for things like this. Um, but here we go. We can now make ourselves a honey block, which we will use to jump off a cliff and, and break our fall. Oh my gosh, the honey block, block is like super clear. What the heck? Well, that's weird. Wait, what? Oh, it said there was a new crafting recipe, and it, like, showed the honey bottles, and I was like, huh? Alright, so let's... Yeah, let's do this. Put the honey block right... Jeez, I'm crow, I can't jump in it. <laughs> it's good to know. Oh, that doesn't count. <laughs> okay, so I actually have to, like, fall, like... Yeah, off of a cliff to to break my fall. So let's go up there. Zoom, zoom. Uh, yeah, this sh this should work. No, okay. Uh, let's put that there. I wonder if it's because I have feather falling. Let's take off my shoes, my fancy socks, I should say. I don't have shoes, I just have fancy socks. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Alright. Where's my advancement? What the frick? Okay, what did that say? It said, jump into a honey block to break your fall. Oh, do I have to do I have to specifically jump? Is that is that what happened? Did I not jump for you? Alright. Alright. Uh-huh. I missed. Okay. Yeah, let's put that there. All right? And then... Oops. I fell. <laughs> and then we'll stack up a little more. What the frick? <laughs> okay. Um... Alright. Alright. Let's... Let's see. Where can I jump off to? I'm gonna put my socks back on. We'll put it right here. That seems that seems like a reasonable spot to put it, right? And then we'll jump off onto that. All right, where was it? I don't remember. I can't see it now. Where did where did it go? What the heck? Where's my honey block? Oh, there it is. Okay, okay, I see it. Oh, I missed. Oh, I missed. Oh, no. Put the shoes back on. Quickery. Uh, let's put it, like, right there. All right. We can totally jump onto that, right? From this little spot. I'm trying to get this advancement because... I don't know. I'm an achievement hunter kind of thing. <laughs> I'm an achievement hunter. More or less. I missed! <laughs> We're not gonna talk about that. It's fine. I just missed. It's fine. It's not a big deal. It's just whatever. I missed again. Are you kidding me? Oh! Okay. One more. One more try. Third time's the charm, right? Alright, where is it? Okay, it's right there. 
That didn't count? Jump into a honey block to break your fall. Alright. Do you know what? I'm gonna do something else. I'll be right back. Alright, guys. Welcome back. As you can see, we towered up. And there's... There's a honey block right below us. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna jump off. We're gonna land on the honey block. And if that doesn't give me the advancement, I don't know what will. So here we go. Are you kidding me? What? What? Huh? Okay, this time, this, this time, I'm gonna risk my 99 levels. And we're gonna go back up. We're gonna we're gonna swim back up. Because I don't I don't trust myself with a firework rocket to land precisely on the Um We're gonna go back up. And this time we're not gonna have feather falling, and we're gonna see if that works. Right? And I swear if it doesn't, I'm gonna cry. I really don't know what else to do. I really don't. Although I don't think I should be up this high without feather falling. Just in general. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you know, maybe not be up this high. So let's, let's dig down a little. Alright, go away, water. I'll be right back when the water recedes. Alright guys, welcome back. The water has receded and I'm gonna I'm gonna dig down a little bit more. Mm. Let's do that, okay? This should be a lethal fall without the honey block. I'm gonna jump in. If it doesn't give me the Achievement, advancement, I'm gonna be real sad. What? Heh! <laughs> what? Okay. Alright, game. I'm so confused. What does it want from me? Alright. Uh, do you know what? I'm gonna look that up. I'm gonna look up what the heck it actually wants. Because this is ridiculous. Um, uh, hold on, let me get rid of this tower. Okay, let me look it up real quick and I'll be right back. I figured it out. It says jump into... Not on. This is how you do it. Wait, wait hold on. I hate this game. <laughs> oh my gosh. I had to wiki that to figure that one out. What? Okay. Yeah, sure. Whatever. There you go. That's how you do it. Pretty simple. You slide into it rather than jumping on it. Uh, so I definitely think that that could be worded better, but uh, alas, it's not. So what can you do, right? All right, let's do a little bit more with the bees. Let's breed them a little bit more. You wink up some flowers. What up, B? How's it going? Oh, what's up, Tiny B? Where's the other dude? Where'd, where'd he go? He just appeared. Did he head back in? Hmm. B? Where'd you go? Lame. They're probably making more honey, so it's fine. Oh, no, no, no. Here he is. Hey, come here, dude. 
Yeah, come here. Come here. Hey, you. Hey, you, come here. Come here, come here, come here. Come here. Why can't I... What? Okay, whatever. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. Aha. Uh -huh. Why can't I... What? There we go. Okay, those... Those two worked for some reason. <laughs> Alright, whatever. It's fine. It's... It's all good. We got some more. Whew. This is... I, I mean, I do like the bees. I, I do like them. I think that they're a fine addition. Um, but the fact that these are the only things that came in 1.15 makes me really kind of just confused. And a little bit disappointed that this is all we got. Granted, I know that, like, overall it is difficult to program an entire new block that has so many different features, right? With the honey block, as well as to add a new mob in addition to that. Um, but it's it's one of those things where it's like, well, I would have much rather preferred, because I see that you're also working on another update, so I would have preferred that the two just come together, and that would have felt like a much better update. Uh, but, I mean, it's kind of like a nice little Christmas gift prior to Christmas. So that's going to be it for this episode. I hope that you guys did indeed enjoy. If you did, a like is very much so appreciated. And if you want to see more content like this, just be sure to subscribe. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. And remember to always stay frosty. Bye-bye.